Hi everyone, it's Raquel of Raquel's Caravan Cuisine and today I'm going to be making one of my favorite dish a delicious pot of curried chicken this pot is packed with flavors absolutely tasty let us begin here i have a whole chicken that i'm just gonna cut into pieces then i'm gonna wash with limes and you can use any parts of the chicken you like whether it be breast or thigh it's really your choice now that the chicken is nice and clean it's time to season add in some salt some black pepper a bit of jerk seasoning yes some all-purpose seasoning and my green season blend then in with the star of the show some curry powder then i'm just going to mix that together link on how to make my green season blend will be down below in the description box but it's basically a blend of skeleton and thyme garlic and onion and pimento peppers Now that this chicken is perfectly seasoned, I'm just going to cover and allow to marinate for about 30 minutes. After about 20 minutes of marinating, because I really could not wait, to a pot over medium heat, I'm just going to add some cooking oil along with some chopped onions and garlic also some curry powder and this term is called burning the curry and i recommend you do not skip out on this part just by allowing the curry to slightly saute with the onions and garlic before adding in the chicken add volumes of flavor to this meal then in with this well seasoned curry chicken now i'm just gonna allow this chicken to soak up all the flavors by just mixing everything together when i tell you this chicken haven't even started to cook and it is smelling absolutely delicious you see the fragrance from the slightly burned curry the garlic and the onion yes man gonna cover this under the lowest heat for about five minutes and after five minutes of simmering the chicken has created its own juice and the secret the top secret to a delicious curry is allowing the meat to cook in its own sauce just for a few minutes before adding in any water do not rush to pour any water just make sure the heat is on medium to low and it will create its own sauce now i'm gonna add some potatoes and carrots which is totally optional some skeleton and thyme and some pimento peppers for flavor then i'm just gonna cover this still under the lowest heat still no water is added for another few minutes This chicken I've been cooking in its own juices for majority of the cooking time. I want to tell you how good this is smelling. But because I want that extra sauce to the same seasoned container, just going to rinse that with some water and add to the chicken. Now I'm going to cover again. For another 10 minutes until the potatoes are fully cooked and that's it it is ready it's as simple as that and this would be one of the best tasting curry you'll ever have the sauce is thick and flavorful and it's no time to serve Thank you so very much for watching if you like this video click the like button 
that will really be appreciated a breakdown of the ingredients will be down below in the description box and please do subscribe then press the notification bell to receive my latest video updates